man. I'm not in Jackass 4. If anybody cares about me, don't go see their movie because I will make mine way f ratter if you just Venmo me a dollar. <laughs> You fell. In a nearly 10 minute tirade about his own suicidal thoughts, and about being p he's been kicked off of Jackass 4, Bam Margera is calling on his fans to boycott the upcoming Jackass 4. Steve-O has been sober as f since since 10 years. If he had a breath light, like he's gonna go camping one day and not have any internet reception. He's gonna sleep through one or two. He's got, like, people, they set me up with such a hard mission that, and then COVID happened for a year against anyone's knowledge. Like, so now I just spend $90,000 in a rehab for 90 days at my expense. <clears throat> I had to go to 30 days in Florida for a rehab at my expense. I had to pay for therapists that they recommended at their expense, but I had to pay for it. <laughs> Bam Margera went on to add that he was fired from Jackass 4 for allegedly being a jackass on TMZ. He then insinuated that he had been thinking of suicide, going as far as to Google how to tie a noose. At one point in the video, Margera, who is clearly agitated, appears to nearly start crying. He has struggled with substance abuse in the past and he may have fallen off the wagon. Who the f cares if I'm drunk as hell or not anymore? Jackass has put me through f***ing hell on f***ing wheels for a year and a half, keeping me in Pennsylvania. I couldn't leave if I left or else I had to breathe in the sobriety link at 3 o'clock every day six o'clock, eight o'clock. Then a random beep would go off. No matter where I was at, I had to stop whatever I was doing and go to an urgent care to go piss. Then I had to wake up every day with a handful of antidepressant pills that I would have to show Paramount Pictures that I took them and swallowed them every single day. In the last update that we posted, Stevo did not mention Bam Margera not being involved. According to Stevo, the cast and crew were able to get some filming done before the shutdown started early last year. While the professional stuntman was bummed they had to stop, he was also hopeful that the team would come to the table with better ideas after being given some extra time to think. Bam roasted the studio and producers behind the Jackass franchise, claiming they used his ideas for the new film but didn't include him in it. I wrote them so many ideas, and if I'm not in the movie, and they use my ideas, how do you think that that'll make me feel? The last thing I want to do is be in a courtroom with Jeff and Tremaine. I love him. What the f***, man? I'm not in Jackass 4. If anybody cares about me, don't go see their movie, because I will make mine way f ratter if you just Venmo me a dollar. Don't go see their movie. Because I will make mine way f ratter. Way f ratter. If you just Venmo me a dollar. <laughs> just a buck. If you send a hundred bucks, I'll remember your name and write it down and straggle it. Dollar. If you send more than that, and I'll do more. But Ten pound is some <clears throat> Jackass was everything to me. And now, now I'm so relieved to get <clears throat> Bam admitted to chugging a glass of wine and seven beers before posting the video on social media. You just Venmo me a dollar. You knocks fell. F you spike. F you Jeff. You f never cared about me, man. <laughs> no, you f fers. 
It is now unclear as to why Margera won't be taking part in Jackass 4 when the production resumes, but it seems to have a lot to do with his struggle with sobriety. Throughout Bam Margera's social media video he calls himself an a-hole and claims that Jackass 4 needs a villain. His wife, Nikki Boyd, can also be seen in the video. Margera has been in the news lately, thanks to some thieves stealing his Bentley from a gas station and then crashing it into a house. Stevo, who has also struggled with substance abuse, has yet to respond to Margera's video, nor has anyone else from the Jackass cast.